Using a 14 millimeter socket and a ratchet, we're gonna go ahead and remove these three bolts holding our rear cat pipe on. I'll go ahead and repeat for the other two. Now, before we go ahead and separate this here, we want to go ahead and get a jack underneath the exhaust to support this. That way that it doesn't fall down. Now that we have the third nut off there, we're going to go ahead and work this bolt out. We want to go ahead and remove these three bolts on this flange right here. Our bolts are too rusted to get any sort of wrench on there. So we're gonna go ahead and use our cutter here. We're gonna cut the head off and punch the stud out on all three of these here. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so we had to use our torch to take the heads off the bolts. We're gonna go ahead and use our hammer to go ahead and separate the two pieces here. So go ahead and pop our cat off here. You wanna make sure that all of your studs are gone. Go ahead and pop that out. I wanna go ahead and clean up our flange here. So I'm gonna go ahead and run this with a little disc. Nope, on this flange here, there's an O-ring gasket that goes around the perimeter. So we're gonna use a series of tools here. We're gonna try a pick, try and get in here and pry some of this out. And we're gonna work our way around the perimeter and clean it out. I'm gonna go ahead and clean up in a side here, get that ready for our new gasket. Use a wire brush around the perimeter. Clean it up the best you can. Also wanna make sure that this side of the flange is nice and smooth. Take your O-ring gasket, we're gonna slide this into place. Let's go ahead and line our cat up into here. Now we did source new bolts here. And go ahead and get these started here. Uh. 
So we do have our three bolts started here. We just want to snug these. Just snug them at this point here. Let's go ahead and get our back gasket in the back here. We'll go ahead and line this up and we're gonna get our bolt started. Let's go ahead and get our Bolts started here. And just continue this around the perimeter. All right, let's go ahead and tighten these down. I'm just gonna come back around just to make sure these are nice and tight. All right, now that everything is tightened up, you wanna go ahead and start up the car, check for any leaks.